I am Danny Rogers coming to you live from Las Vegas. The Lions picked up their most dominating win of this season in week 13, and we're talking all about it. Defensive lineman Aiden Hutchinson intercepting the ball is not normal in the NFL, <laughs> and he's doing it as a rookie. Jared, we've heard about the changes the offense is making, play action, change of tempo. How have you seen your offense acclimate to that so far? Yeah, I think guys are just taking ownership of it, especially up front. You had Ben Johnson, your offensive coordinator, in your ear for the first time. How do you do? He's doing a hell of a job. Rookie linebacker James Houston had his welcoming moments to the NFL Thursday against the Bills. His stat line included one fumble recovery and two sacks. You heard head coach Dan Campbell in that Hard Knocks preview <laughs> just say they're at a whole different level than they were last year. Head coach Dan Campbell said coming into this game, the only way that running back Saquon Barkley, who leads the NFL in rushing yards, is a non-factor in games is when he isn't playing. Kaminsky has grown a lot. 26 quarterback pressures in his first three seasons in the league, so that's good for about eight pressures a season, 39 this season. That's only That's second to Aiden Hutchinson, who has 50. Offensive lineman Penny Sewell, receiver Amon Ross St. Brown, they thanked you this past week for bringing them here to Detroit. What is your response to them? <laughs> hey, that's, uh, that means a lot. Um, those guys, um, you, you uh, go through a lot. They never get emotional with this, but. Rookie linebacker Malcolm Rodriguez is a player that this coaching staff has been raving about. Defensive coordinator Aaron Glenn accidentally gave Rodriguez the nickname Rodrigo and didn't think it would stick, but it certainly has. We've talked about a few position battles on offense. What will be the emphasis in the second half to keep seeing those position battles play out? Yeah, listen, make the plays that are there for you to make. Oh, Sway with a little semi. A little to the right. Back to the right. And it is time for Rogers retweets. This might be one of my favorite weeks so far because the first person I'm featuring is my very own dad. This is Michael Rogers, everyone. He whipped this sweater out after the Chicago Bears defeat, and I am in awe. I didn't even know he had this sweater. Touchdown, lights up.